Hey guys, Christian Pulisic here, and this is my Like a Pro. This is Pulisic now getting the breakaway chance. All and away from Mendy. Christian Pulisic one on one with Edison. Yeah. Strokes it into the bottom corner. Composure from Pulisic. My old coach Hannes Wolf actually told me, don't go in there as a fan. Um, go in there as your own player and your own man. And that's what I always, I always try to do, that I don't, I don't look at any situation and say, oh wow, these are some big players. These are like, I go in and I, I do what I do and, 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 I, and I do my best and, and maybe I can bring something new to, to the table. <laughs> My biggest athlete inspiration was actually Tiger Woods. Um, growing up, I just loved his mentality. I just felt like he worked he worked so hard to, to be as good as he was. Pulisic away from Torkan Tarkovsky. Still going Pulisic, time to pass well. The confidence is, is the most important thing, especially as an attacking creative player. Sometimes you have to be willing to take risks um, to help the team. You have to be okay with making mistakes at times. That's, that's a really important part of what I do. And Pulisic has found him here. Tight angle. He was looking for Giroud. Pulisic! Yeah! 1-0 Chelsea! Brilliant goal! Gone round holding as if he wasn't there. Pulisic! Oh no. Not a hamstring, not another one. Surely not. The toughest hurdle in my career so far I would say would be uh, the injuries that I had the last two seasons. Uh, the one that was a really tough one was ju just before the lockdown. During that time I think patience was also just really important. I think I had told myself by this game I, I need to be back playing and when I just had that in my head where I need to be back by this moment it wasn't it wasn't giving me the right the right clarity and the right mindset to really just make sure and say you know what get myself 100% right, and then I'm, then I'm gonna go. Um, I learned a lot about myself in that way, and uh, just finding the right time, and, and just knowing that uh, the time will come, and it all, it all worked out and happened for a reason. I would say that the number one thing that has you know, been a big part of my career is, I don't know a word for it, but it's like making myself uncomfortable. So putting myself in situations that I'm maybe not the best in or something that I'm not particularly good at is working at that constantly. My weaker foot, for example, coming inside and using my weaker foot and I felt like I wasn't as strong. I constantly worked on it and worked on my crossing and shooting and, and trying to do stuff with, with the weak foot. I think there's a lot of ways you can you can translate it. In whatever career it is, maybe if there's a, a field or, or, or just a certain task that you're not particularly good at, it's not your strength. Is, is going out of your way and taking time and saying, you know what, I want to improve on this and going home and constantly practicing on, on that one every single day and, and, and just getting better and it's really just bettering yourself and, and in whatever it is that you do. Pulisic has yeah. squeezed it in, that's brilliant! How did he squeeze it in? Pulisic, this is worth a hit, oh. he's done it again! Still in there. Pulisic! Yeah. Patrick! What an evening for Christian Pulisic! I think my, my biggest takeaway, especially recently, is um, maybe things aren't gonna go in exactly the way or the the plan the plan that you exactly had hoped for, but I think that everything happens for a reason, and I really do trust that and believe in that. And uh, to just make the make the best out of every situation. Uh, that's what I that's what I've tried to do. And uh, instead of instead of complaining or or you know making excuses, it's just making the best out of the the, the situation that you're in. Thanks for listening, guys. I'm Christian Polisic, and that was my like a pro. Sweet. Thanks, up.